been in tears ever since your mother left. Baby, please, I'm dying to know what it is that you will find it so difficult to say to me. Please, my love, just talk to me, please. You mean you don't know? Baby, I know my offense. I know how much I messed up. That's why I've been begging you to please have mercy. Just find a way in your heart to forgive me. Don't tell me, baby, that I have lost everything. Please. Jacob, how? How could you have done this to my life? Baby, everything I, I tried to do was for the both of us. I, I was trying to find money so that we could get married. I, I, I wanted us to get married and settle down. Now that I have the house done, I have everything. I can sell this house and we can move to the UK together. Please, just forget about everything that's happened between your mother and, the, and myself. Just let go of it. Just let's... We have no family to build. No future together. Everything is ruined. Everything is taken away. Take of everything. Everything is taken away. your assignment if you want to get my money. No, no, no. That is not what I am asking for. What I want is to do the same duty as Jeff is doing. I want to service your bottom place and the reward that follows. If you want that, then do what I asked you to do. That would be very hard. No. No. I am a professional in the other room. I am not a killer. Bernard. Can we go to my house? You give me HIV. I ran a test in the hospital before coming down to Nigeria and I was negative. And Jeff, you are the only person I have ever had a thing with ever since then. And now I am, I am positive! No. You mean I'm positive? No! You infected me! I can't be positive! You did infect me with black! No! No! How? No! No! Can I be positive at this time when things are getting better? When? No! No! I'm positive now! How? My life is gone. You've taken everything I have from me, Jeff. You've taken my life away from me, Jacob. Oh. Oh. I'm positive, Jeff. Positive. I can't be positive. Can't be positive now. This is time for me to even enjoy my life now. No, I cannot be positive now. I cannot be positive. Yeah, but having a great time. <laughs> Come on, baby boy, it's time for us to start the real action. Come on. Oh, Come really? On. Mm -hmm. Do you, go in there. Do you have condoms? 
I don't do condoms. Why? Condoms are important for protection. You don't know my status and I don't know your status, you know what I'm saying, so... We are not here to check status, we are here for business, maybe. So let's get serious with this okay, business, okay. come on. It's about the money, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> and you look healthy, you look strong, I don't think you have any infection, so... <laughs> let's come with me. Yeah, let's get down to business. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, let's go. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> No, no, I'm ready now. God, God, God. You see, there is no future for us. No home. No freaking home to build, Jacob. Everything. Everything is taken away because of your stupidity. I'm just, just running myself in the mortuary. Oh, the mortuary. Oh, why in the name of fiber pension? Oh, because I want to find my pension. He's running me in the mortuary. Oh. HIV. I can't <laughs> HIV now. <laughs> I don't want to say what I don't want to for myself now. Life is so Mom? Thank God this is true, for Christ's sake. Is anything the matter? <sighs> Nothing, sweetheart. It's just a dream. Mm. A dream. Yes. Uh, my angel. See, I want you to take Jeff off your mind. Take that mind, that man away from you. I want you to go back to London as soon as possible, please. To hell with him. I don't think I will ever have any business to do with that. That shameless fool. He doesn't have a good intention towards you. Mom, what was the dream all about? Ah, uh, sweetheart. Nothing. It was just um it was just a dream. See. That man doesn't have any good thing in mind for you. Throw him out of your mind. Go back to the States. You know you are my only child. I don't want anything to happen to you. Go back to London as soon as possible. Please. I will go to Abuja to see Dad. From there I'll be going to London. Oh. That's better. Thank you. Can you get me water? Money. Just for the money, stay for my game. Anyway, now wait. Anyway, now wait. I am not positive. I am not HIV positive. Oh, hell no. No. I got no one but only you. Anything you say, I would do. If you want, I could ask you. Me and you, we go enter the place. I go rock you where we go. I am negative, right? You can see for yourself. Oh, thank God. Oh, what a horrible dream I had. Oh, thank God I am negative. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. 
Here comes another congratulation. Second envelope. Yeah, okay. check it out. Well, on the course of running the test, we detected that you are two months pregnant. <gasps> Is there something? Is there anything the problem? Or you're not ready for that now? Oh, no, 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 no. No. Oh, this is a miracle. It's a miracle I expected for 20 years now. Oh, this was actually what took me out of my husband's house. Oh, well, thank you. So thank sorry you. about that. <sighs> So I'm pregnant. I'm pregnant. Yeah, sure, you are. Oh. Uh, so, um, I must take my leave and have a nice day. Okay, then. Not at all, Dad. The journey was awesome, but quite far. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's fine, Father. <laughs> wow. So good to have you around. Me too. I'm so happy to see you. <laughs> you okay? Yes, Father. I'm fine. So how is everything? <coughs> Father, please. Come, come, come. Get water. Get water. Yes, sir. Get water. Can I use a cup? Please, please. Right away. Hope you're good. <coughs> Shit. Fast. Okay. Keep it here. Keep it here. Let her come. Okay. Please, I don't want. My father. Please forgive me. I am so sorry for bringing shame to your reputation. I didn't mean to. I'm, I'm so ashamed of myself. Dad, I was deceived into it. Now listen, Chantel. You are the only daughter of a Brutal military general who does not take shit from anybody, be it high or the mighty. And I cannot start it now. I know I love you, but that love can switch to hate. If you keep contesting my orders. If that boy is good enough to get you pregnant, he should be good enough to be your husband. <laughs> and that is final. But Dad, we've broken up. That's why your relationship that got broken up. Not the marriage. Listen. I command you to call that idiot before me now. Father. It's already over between us. I don't want to go back to him. Please. Chantel. Dad. I shall not hesitate to switch from your father to a commander. 
I command you, call that idiot now! <laughs> Now that I'm pregnant for your baby, I'm making up plans for us to relocate to Switzerland. What do you think about that? Really? Mm -hmm. Switzerland? Mm -hmm. Baby, are you serious? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Damn, my angel, that's why you are the best. I mean, you are just the best. You know what? Mm -mm. Once we get to Switzerland, I promise to give you as many sweets, babies as you like. <laughs> are you on? Are you on five ten? <laughs> <laughs> I don't just want my husband to know our whereabout for the rest of his life. If he does, nothing. Our marriage is dead already. You have one more round. Hmm? 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 Well, you look tired. I'm sure. I hope you're not tired. I hope I'm not uh, exhausting you. No, I'm not. Uh, you see. Yourself, that abortion is the only solution to unwanted pregnancy. You live in a Western world, you should know that. Abortion is the only solution to unwanted pregnancy. Walk into any farm and say, Watch up. What's wrong with you? Don't call my phone again. Or don't call my number again. You call my number again, I'll kill you. What's wrong with you? Or tell that to your useless father. Tell him that a cup of Gary is nearly 1,000 naira. Not back in his time that a bag of Gary was 10 kobo. Listen to me, you are not even pregnant. Eh? You, you, you just miss your period. Just go and wash up. Go and wash up. Flush up. Even a quack nurse is able to, to, to dry clean your womb. What's wrong with you? Do I, do, do I sound like I'm joking? Do I sound like I'm joking? Go and wash up, man. Don't, don't, don't call my phone again. You, 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 are, you, are you a witch? Are you a witch? Did, did, did they send you to, to, to come and scatter my life? What's wrong with you? Don't call my phone. Come on, I'll, I'll kill you. <laughs> you know, you don't get a problem. You know, I just say make a day here. You know, just wait for you so that you go f finish your call so that I will greet you and go my way. Good morning, sir. C -c 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 come here. Come here. What sir? did you say? What uh, did you say? Uh, 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 what time is it? Oh, sorry, sir. Good afternoon, sir. Ogoro, come here. Uh, no, no, not Ogoro. Ogoro, whatever. Is it, is, it, is it in the afternoon? So you don't you don't tell time anymore. He, but, but, I don't understand though. What do you call sign watch? Call sign greeting here now. 
So you, you, you so now you're arguing with me. What you concern what what you are concerned greeting? So you're arguing with me. You see, I said you're stupid. You see, I'm almost telling you you're very stupid, Ogoro. I go talk. You go talk what? I go I go I go I go talk what? She 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 she. You go there happy now? Say when Madam go here, say person get belly. Say say person get belly. They go talk. Say I'm talking about. Shut up. Shut up. Okay, no, no, no. Uh, oh, hey, 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 Oh, Goro! Ah! This guy is the best. Best in my flesh. What? He's just always around. Just everywhere. Just in my. Just. Just. He, he hang everywhere. Just to give me a problem. Ah! Why he had to even hear what he had to talk now? Complicating my life. This case is simple. One must go for the other. Because you cannot marry mother and daughter at a time. Shante is most definitely your wife now. Huh? What are you even talking? What are you even saying? Eh? Okay. Let me explain something to you. Because I know right now I can trust you. Huh? Okay. As we are speaking, my sugar mama and I have already made plans to relocate, to settle abroad. You know what that means when we talk about settling abroad? I don't know and I don't want to know why you should choose an old woman over a young, beautiful, single lady. Why? Because of money, my brother, money! I don't come this time, come look age. Who age help? For this town, money that they brought for this town. Okay, you know what? Let's put sentiments aside. Let's put friendship aside. Advise me as a barrister, as my legal counsel. What should I do? Not every action that is legal is wise. I still maintain my stand that you should you should go in the way of wisdom. Like they said, wisdom is profitable to the right. no, let, Let's forget this matter. I will advise myself, let's forget this matter. Okay? But God knows that I will not allow Chantel to stand in the way of my of my fine boy pension. No, not at all. Nobody will stand in the way of my interests. Anybody who wants to stand in the way of my fine boy pension will either die or I will die protecting my pension. You need this to come? Yes, I need it. I will drink it. That's not what I want from you. Return titles. So, my daughter will be traveling to Delta tomorrow. I want you and your boys to keep an good eyes on her. I don't know if you understand what that means. Yes, so. so. You have to be very smart about this assignment. Very, very smart. I think someone is up to some mischief. So be careful. Yes, sir! 
in case you need anything, always keep in touch with the logistic department. Yes, so and very importantly, all the details of our locations and assignments. Yes, sir. Yes. Please. Please. Yes, sir. Good luck. Wow. It's okay. It's about So, please. Everybody play. Everybody's Can you move? Yes, so you can go. And everybody He wants me to come around, you know, to talk. Emergency? Mm hmm. I, I think I should go and see him and know what it's about. You know, I'll give you a call once I get there, okay? It's okay. Okay, baby. Yeah. So, uh, <clears throat> yeah, I'll, I'll see you soon, okay? Every rubbish she has in her system, call, calling it a child. Flush it out. Jeff, what now? Jeff, can you think I will be so. And you think I would be so foolish to agree to that? I thought there was something important that warranted this uh, emergency. But uh, there is nothing more important than getting Chateau out of my life. There is nothing more important. Ha! That girl! My village people have sent her for me. They've sent her for me. She's, she's been sent to destroy my fine boy pension that is about to materialize. I'm telling you, that girl has been sent. Eh? She's a witch. I'm telling you, then count me out. In fact, we never had this discussion. Period. Bernard, so you're not going to help me. Guys, you're not going to help me. Okay, you know what? I'll give you one. Yeah, I'll give you one million. 
Yes, now let me just give you the money so you just do this thing. Let's, let's forget it. Ah. Yes. Are you that desperate? Are you that desperate to kill your own child? You are wicked. What is your problem? Bro, this life is about money, oh. So you come to you, they talk as if we day Sunday school or we 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 are in church. Eh? We're talking about money, we're talking about life, we're talking about future, I'm talking about retirement. Do you know how long I spent doing doing this for another business? What if something goes wrong? Everything I've already gone wrong. I'm only trying to fix it, to bring things back together. How? You don't even understand what I'm what I'm maybe going through. Eh? Do you know how hard I've worked? Do you, know, do, you, do you know what it means to, to, to be servicing uh, 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 that, that kind of woman? Do you, do you, do you know how much work I've, I've done? Shouting, shouting like that now. Nobody give me number. Nobody give, give, give me a number. Say, make I, make I, can you that girl go, go lot for uh, uh, Moderna Hotel? And so? And so? So that means you should shut down the whole house? Hey, no, no, no. She totally stopped picking my call. I, I, I like this girl number there. Since last night, now. Nah. I go, call number, number. Shut, shut, shut. What is it now? Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. She's dead now. I don't care. I don't care about that girl. I don't care. She doesn't want to pick. It's up to her. She wants to pick. It's up to her. What I want you to do is, whenever she comes here, just make sure that she doesn't enter this, enter this compound. That's exactly she doesn't cross that gate. That's exactly what I will tell her. Hey, tell her to travel. Exactly. I will just tell her that, 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 that you traveled, that your girl traveled, and must not enter inside this compound. Exactly. Exactly. Tell her, tell her, tell her I traveled. What is it now? Nonsense. No, 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 no. uh, huh? You know what it means to for us to dial a number and wait before you connect. And when the thing go connect, be you go ring, green, 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 you call nobody you agree. And the caller, go, 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 what was it? She said, Sorry, sir. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. I'll punch you. No, no, sorry, no. Sorry. Ah. Get out. Hmm? I should get out. Get out. Or I should go. 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 Okay, sir. No, this is that. Eh? Can you imagine? You think it's easy, easy for what to go, make go, go? Sorry, sir.
you stand here to tell me that my daughter was shot? A girl I asked you to keep an eye on? So, we did exactly. But you want us not to get close to her so she doesn't notice us. Excuse me? You really mean what you're saying? That my daughter was shot dead? It's quite a pity, so. But so, we were able to trace her telephone conversations and she was always having a quarrel with somebody on the phone. Presumably the young man she was pregnant for. My daughter is dead. That's what you're telling me. That my only child is dead. Now listen. I want every single person involved in this. Make sure you pick everybody. All. They all must be apprehended immediately. Yes, sir. And again, it is not a civil case. So leave police and judiciary out of it. Yes, sir. I must handle it the army way. Yes, sir. Then the faster you say the truth, 
the better you help your own life. There are nothing that they do with that thing. But no, no. If I will shut her, I don't know what to waste your time. If I will, I don't talk about fire. If I lie, he not listen to me. If I lie, my brother fire me. No matter. Now, tell me, make I carry the girl go to the hotel. Now, tell me, make I carry the girl go to the hotel. Now, my girlfriend. Now, my girlfriend, first one in there. My girlfriend. Now, you would confess this before the general. If you, if I don't do it, make I shut up. I said. Before the general. To 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 God. Shut up. Come in. Why did you kill her? Chantel. This is Chantel. She's, she's not dead. She's alive. I can see you don't want to save your life. You killed her. Yes! No. I did not kill her. She is not dead. She's alive. She was pregnant for you? Yes, she told me she was pregnant and I haven't seen her ever since then. And you killed her? No. Because you asked her to abort the baby and she refused? I, I only told her that I wasn't ready for marriage so if she had a baby it was going to complicate everything. That was why you killed her? I did not kill Chantel. So who did you send to do? She's alive. She's not dead. I see you're not ready to save your life. The last time I saw Chantel, she was alive. Officer, I, she's not dead. I, the I'm only thing I want from you right now is the truth. And if you're not ready to say the truth, then I believe my boys are here to finish up with you. I am saying... Shit! Shut up. The truth, or you keep quiet. I don't know. I said, I... shut up! I want you to go in as Jeff's lawyer. My husband is a brutal general. Let me ask you a question. Mm. Are you actually sure that Jeff did not kill her? No, he didn't. You are his friend. You should know that Jeff is not a killer. Okay. So what do you want me to do now? I want you to go in as his counsel. Take this case to court before my husband killed Jeff. You want me to be his lawyer? Okay. That means we have to discuss um, before I swim into action. One more thing, please. See, my husband must not have an idea that I have any relationship of any form with Jeff. Why? In this case. Why, if I may ask? I want it that way. In this case. Anyway, now, well, 
pick and we play just for the money stay so how much are you going to anyway pay me for my Anyway, now wait. I love you, Mama Ray. God, that I got no one but only you, only you. to help with another baby. baby. Hey, now you want to bring the money. money. Hey, I love you, Mama Ray. God, that don't tell me it is what I think. You too. now I need to know nothing but the food so I can defend you you know the truth Bernard the truth is I am not the killer the truth is I did not even know she was dead that's the truth as a judge. He's a fool. Scallywag. Ah! What's all this? Just look at. I want to come and stand and speak English. Meanwhile, my daughter is in the work. No, 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 wait! What's all this? Can't happen. Mm -mm. No, 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 no! Stands now, you are the only one that can save Jeff's life. How do you mean? Am I supposed to be his lawyer? <laughs> you, you don't get it. Now listen, the diseased girl in question is your biological daughter. The army general who wants to execute Jeff is your husband. Now, Jeff is your sugar boy. 
and he was with you that same day your daughter was murdered. What does that mean? Simple. If you can come and testify to that, Jeff won't be executed. What are you even saying? You want me to testify in front of my husband? A brutal general? Okay, what am I supposed to tell him? That I was at home making love with my sugar boy. The same boy that is suspected to be the mother of my daughter. My husband knows that my daughter was my arch enemy. Do you know what that means? <sighs> Madam, this case is under the handling of an army general. And if very substantial evidences are needed to disengage this case from military to civil. Before talking about the fate of my client. I've told you why I'm fighting this case. If you leave Jeff there, he will mention my name. And if my name is mentioned, I am finished. Can't you see? I, I, I guess I'm protecting other interests apart from that of my client. It's obvious. Well, I charge specially for that. Say, 10 million naira. 10 million what? Naira. Do you really want to save your friend? My friend worked for his money. I am working for my money. Ten million naira else. I will make you an eyewitness. That other client of yours, this is the end of the road for him. The death of a general's daughter is worth wiping off his entire household. I employ you, General. We are in a democratic era. Matters like this are best handled in the court of law. Never! This is the case of the mother of the general's daughter. So it must be done the better way. I will give you the chance to come and prove whatever you want to prove. That it must be done the military way. And I shall be the judge. Military case deserves military action. General. General. I am very sure that my client has no hand in the mother of your daughter. And that is what I want to prove before a court of jurisdiction. I hate to repeat myself, Mr. Barrister. I shall grant you the chance to save your client's life. But it must be done the military way. And I shall be the judge. Again, military case deserves military action. I will advise you, Mr. Barrister, to go get yourself ready for Tuesday, 12 noon. We meet again. All for now, Mr. Barrister. As long as the life of my client is assured. Until I am convinced.
I'm here. My daughter was murdered. And you're yet to break silence. I smell rat right in your direction. Which daughter are you talking about? Who else? Your worst enemy while she was alive. Chantel. Oh, no. My daughter is alive. Chantel is alive. <laughs> Olivia. Olivia. I have a corpse in first headquarters mortuary. Now listen. I will leave no stone unturned in fishing out the murderer. And if by any means my trace points your direction, I will fish you out whatever you are hiding. I will fish you out. Excuse me? Is this a conspiracy against me because I filed a divorce? You can run. But surely you cannot hide from my such light. Speaking, heads will roll. Yes. Five minutes late. I'm sorry, but well, we have a bigger problem now. My husband called. He threatened my life. Should he find any trace of my daughter's mother towards my direction? I thought you called this meeting in favor of my 10 million naira demand. Money is not the problem. I want you to save my life. I know my husband, he doesn't make empty threats. I might get you the money now, or not. The money is not the issue here. I want you to assure me that you will save my life. In fact, I want you to make sure that my husband doesn't find any trace between I and Jeff. Okay? Please make sure he doesn't find out anything. Save my life. How am I getting the money? The money is not the problem. But you have to assure me that you will save my life. Don't you think we are beginning to belabor this case already? This is no longer about Jeff. It's about my life. And I want you to understand why I'm paying you the sum of 10 million naira. I am not being paid yet. I have not seen a lot. Uh, let's hit the bank.
Mr. Jeff. Mr. Jeff, I have the following questions to ask you, and you are left with the options yes or no. Are you ready? Yes. Good. You turn the right on, sir? Right on. Go with you. Mr. Jeff. Let me Chantal Ukeje was pregnant for you as at the time of her mother. Yes or no? Yes. Point one. Scott. Good. That takes us to the next question, General. Yeah, go ahead. Did you at any point try to cause her to abort the pregnancy. And she refused. I mean, did you cause her to abort the pregnancy against her own will? Yes. Point two. I hope the barista is taking note of all this. Another question for you. Was there any time you threatened to kill Miss Chantel if she refuses to do your bidding? And such threat was passed right in front of your barrister here. Did you? Uh, uh, yeah. We're getting there. Another question, Mr. Judge. Are you aware, Mr. Jeffrey, that Chantel was killed on the same day and on her way to the hotel you instructed your security man to take her to while you returned from your so-called fake journey? I do not know when she was murdered. The option says, Mr. Jeff, yes or no. General, I feel my client here is being bullied by the investigating officer. Let him finish. Thank you, General. Mr. Jeff, is it true that you were planning to run out of the country with your so-called girlfriend? as at the time of Shantae's mother. Yes. Good. I think this case is settling itself already, General. Okay. Another one for you, Mr. Jeff. Was your so-called girlfriend also pregnant for you as at the time Shantae took in? For you? Yes. The mathematics are beginning to fix themselves. So you actually killed Miss Chantel because you do not want to ruin your chances of traveling to Thailand with your so-called pregnant girlfriend. I did not kill Chantel. In essence, you are trying to let us know that your so-called girlfriend did a deed. I, 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 I... The option is yes or no. Yes. Uh, General, my client should be allowed to answer in his own words. Mm. That is fair enough. Barrister, this is not your regular court. Allow him to finish. So, Mr. Jeff, uh, another question for you. Did you lie to Chantel that you were not in town as the day she was coming to see you? Whereas you were in the house with your girlfriend. General, General, my client already answered the same question the investigating officer is asking him. 
Then why is he stuttering? Twisting same question in different ways can be so confusing, especially to an already traumatized suspect like my client. Then get the so-called woman to answer for herself. This meeting is over. We'll convene in two weeks' time. He demands to see his pregnant girlfriend in our next meeting in two weeks. And go and get his girlfriend. I presume that is you. Should I remind you that I told you from the onset not to get my name involved in this case? You don't get it. You don't get it, do you? The Military Investigation Bureau already got their facts. It's too late. There is no way I will get myself involved in this case. Do, 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 do you understand? Getting myself involved in this case is suicidal. Oh, come on. Should I remind you that every lawyer is trained to dispute facts and back it up with favorable laws? It's your field. I don't need to tell you that. So you go out there, back it up with whatever law you get in your book. Take me out of this case. I don't want to be involved. Uh, well, it will only cost you five million naira to maneuver your presence. Five million, you said. Hmm. I'll give you seven million. Take me out of this case. and let them protest against this unlawful detention. I have done all that. Who does it in a major general, Okeji? His influence spread across all sectors in this country, especially the judiciary. So I'm going to die in here for a crime I did not commit. By the way, how did the secret agent get to know all those informations? Because he was too direct. Oh God, but that it, it beats my imagination. I said no such things to him. I do not know. Then who did? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. Ugur, my, my, my get mad. Probably he talks a lot. He's a talkative. Maybe he said something to the detective, but I don't know nothing. I know nothing about it. I didn't talk to him. Listen to me, my sugar mama. What is she doing about this? Is she trying to get me out? Is she using her influence or anything to get me out? Uh, um, she is actually financing your freedom. It's just that this case is in the mouth of a hungry lion. So you're, you're telling me I'm, I'm 
going to die here. Die in this place. Die for something I did not do. Die. Just like that. No, you won't die. Everyone is doing their best to get you out of here. I don't feel it. I don't feel it. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at me. Look at my face. Look at me. Look at my face. You are doing your best. Be positive. You will get out of here. For sure. <laughs> I demanded that the woman in question be present in this meeting. Where is she? Um, General, the woman in question was never aware of Jeff's relationship with Chantel. She only got to find out that Jeff got another woman pregnant besides her. And she's so traumatized and mad at the entire situation. Arista, that is her business. She has sued for privacy and never wanted her name mentioned in this case. That is her business too. Lieutenant, so you have a link to that woman? So, this criminal jail seems to be so smart that he kept his entire dealings with Chantel completely away from the so-called woman. And every attempt to have a trace of this woman amounts to grasping the air. I suspect too that that woman must be a criminal. How sure are you that he has, she hasn't detected the secret communication? that resulted to the death of my daughter. I vouch for That's that. That's the point. I vouch for that, General. The woman only got to know 10 days ago. I vouch for that. Mr. Barrister, you vouch for no one. I want that woman here. No more excuses. Meeting, 10 days time. Everybody must be here. Present. The person that introduced you to me said um, that you're three months pregnant. Yes. Then you have to save my life and that of Jeff's. So how exactly do you want me to come in? See, Jeff was with me on that day. I know very well that he had no hand in that. And now they want me to testify in front of my husband. How do I stand in front of my estranged husband to testify in favor of the person they are suspecting to be the one that killed my daughter? And my husband knows that I and my daughter are act enemies. If I do that, he will look at it as a conspiracy. So you want me to stand in your place? Oh, yes. For two million naira. I'll show you the house and get you acquainted. After that, I'll take you to Jeff's lawyer's place where he will tell you what to say in court. That's just that. You know I'm a born-again Christian and a choir mistress in my church. What do you want the church to do when they find out I still go around fornicating? This is not fornication. It's not going to be a public case. It's not a, this is not a public case. 
It's something that is going to be handled in my husband's office. So not everyone that will get to hear about this. It's, it's a private discussion. So why just two million? I'll pay you three million. Is that okay? Here is a booklet containing all possible questions okay. you might be asked on that day. I want you to study them, get acquainted with them. I will do that. If there's something you don't understand, you can pick his number and call him immediately. Okay. Amaka, listen to me. On no account should you make reference to Madame Olivia, no matter the pressure mounted on you, have I made myself clear? Yes. Do you understand? Yes, I promise you everything will go accordingly. Good. We leave in six days' time. Good. All right. Uh, if you trust her, I trust her. I trust the source that brought her to me. We will be fine. Stop that noise now. Stop that noise now! Do you think you are in some makeup shop or hairdressing salon? Are you ready to confess who sent you now? Please have a confess. Jesus, please help me have a confess. <laughs> Go ahead and do that right now.
why I sent you to come and lie in front of the general. Is that what you were saying? He said that. And the general insisted that he brings um, um, Jeff's pregnant girlfriend. <laughs> and they paid me to come my presenter. You were paid to represent his pregnant girlfriend. Is that it? Yes, sir. And who is the so called pregnant girlfriend? <laughs> I cannot say. <laughs> they beat me to not reveal her identity. I see. You are really enjoying your stay in the bedroom. No. No, sir, please. I beg you, sir, please. I've told you the truth. Will suffer. <laughs> Nigerian army. Of course you are. Is it not a shame that you allowed a criminal to infiltrate your garrison and kill the suspect in your custody? Oh, come on. Now listen. I want you to do everything within your powers to fish out the killers of that suspect with immediate effect. Yes, sir. We are already on it, sir. Away with your useless promises. If you don't fish out those killers, you will die in his place. Can you go? You will die in his place. Out. Yes, so. It's a game. First of all, the world is a game. Everybody's playing this game. Oh, it's a game. Everybody playing. Everybody's playing on their own interest. And everybody really wishing they are gonna win. It's a game. Everybody playing, life is a game, it's all game, game, game. Everybody playing, everybody play. Everybody's playing this game. Oh, it's a game. Everybody playing. Everybody's playing on their own interest. And everybody really wishing they are gonna win. It's a game. 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 Everybody playing. Life is a game. It's a game. Everybody playing, everybody playing 